Hello, in this video we will download softwares which will be required to start designing your own VLSI circuits. So we need to download four things. First, Java. Second, Java 3D API. Third, Electric in which we will design all our circuits. Fourth is LT Spice which will be used to simulate the circuit's design. So we will begin with Java. Open your browser. Now, in your browser, we need to go to the page cmosedu.com. So, type cmosedu.com. In this, you go to Electric VLSI. In Electric VLSI, we will first click on java.com. Now, you might have an earlier version of Java. So, you will first check. Do I have Java? and you will have to verify your java version make sure that you have the latest java version so you click on verify see now i have the latest java version if you don't have the latest one make sure that you install the latest one and delete the older versions after you are done with java we will go to another page oracle oracle.com as we need to download java 3d api right now we'll first we'll download them from oracle.com in oracle.com we will have to go to downloads in downloads you will down go to java se that is within the bar popular downloads in java se you will open java apis that is on the right side under java resources now after the page opens, just scroll down, go to other technologies and click on Java 3D. Now you, you need to download the API. Which API? 1.5.1. Now this will redirect you to this page here you will you have to first accept license agreement now you will be able to download these as we are learning the installation for windows we will either download win this file or this one now amd64 denotes the 64 bit format and i586 exe denotes the 32 bit format now you need to check your java version is a 32 bit or a 64 bit file to do that you will go to your C drive program files now the people who have 86 64 bit format will have two program files one will be x86 and one will be only program files and now I don't have a 64 bit format so I have only one folder of program files in which I will look out for Java yes I have Java present so check if your Java is present in the 64 bit format program files or the 32 bit format program files once you're sure with it download Java 3D API Now since I have already downloaded it, I won't download it again. Next what you got to do is you need to go to your C drive, create a new folder named electric. Now I have already created one here. After you create the new folder, you have to download electric in this folder itself. So we will go to the page electric at cmosedu.com. We need to download electric-9.05.jar file. 
and this file will be stored in the folder electric so specify the path and make sure while you are storing it it is in the dot jar format and not in the zip format after you've done downloading you have to open and check if it is running so double click and this is what your electric will look like if your electric doesn't run so we we will have to make it run with java so what will we do for that right click open with choose default programs browse we'll go to c drive program files in program files we'll go to java now go to the java latest version that you have mine is 8.03 and not the earlier one in that you'll go to bin in bin you will you will select java w which is an executable file application and you'll open and you'll say okay as soon as you click okay your electric will start now you are done with installing three things now you have to install the fourth thing that is ld spice to install ld spice we'll come to this page again here we'll click here on ld spice then ensure that ld spice is installed on your computer we'll click on ld spice i'll just open it in a new tab Then a page with linear technology, page of linear technology will open, wherein you will have to download LT Spice four for Windows. If it asks to register, just say no thanks. And store LT Spice in the same folder electric. Now I have already downloaded. so i won't download it again after you install a shortcut might be created and it will open so just close the opened window and come back here now what do you need to do you need you to link your electric with the lt spice only then will you be able to simulate all the circuits so to do that you have to follow the commands that you have written that are written here so firstly we will open electric I have a shortcut on the desktop you might go to C drive and then open it then in which we'll go to file preferences there we'll go to tools spice serial in spice serial you have to make sure that the spice engine is 3 spice level is 3 resistor shorting none parasitic trans area and perim only globals use dot global block spice per primitive set spice parts and you have to check only for no header cards and no trailer cards now in running spice we will have to select in after writing deck as run ignore output now if the field with args is empty and run program is empty you will have to fill it now what will you fill it with open the browser the window here it is written with args field you can just copy this file and paste it copy this directory and paste it in the in the preferences and in run program you will have to type this you can select either this c program 1 ltc lt spice 4 scat3.exe or you can select this one Make sure that all these text boxes are selected. If you have not selected any, do so. After you are you are done with saying this, you say apply and say okay. Now again open file preferences. Now we'll go to general. General. In general. Make maximum memory as five one two megabytes. 
and maximum permanent space as 128 megabytes. Say apply and OK. With this, you are ready to use your electric and simulate your circuits with LT Spice. Thank you.